Hello all, let us talk about the differences between push-pull and totem-pull output configurations. So, these are the common configurations that are used in digital ICs, right? So, let us look at the major differences. So, totem-pull output, if you see, uh, it is more formed by uh, the PNP and NPN. Uh, actually, Push-pull is formed more uh, uh, with the MOSFETs. So you see push-pull configuration in our devices. Uh, Totem-pull is used more when we talk uh, about uh, the TTL logic. Okay, And um, the intention of these particular uh, uh, configurations is Totem-pull output and push-pull uh, can both be used in digital circuits the major difference between them is the push pull can give more drive current and uh, which is why it is used in amplifier configurations so both can sync as well as source but push pull has higher capability that's the major advantage so if you see the efficiency perspective of uh, totem pole versus push pull, uh, push pull has higher efficiency. That's another advantage. And again, as we talked, applications wise, uh, more in power amplifiers and then uh, um, uh, digital circuits, uh, uh, push pull is used. Uh, only in uh, if you see logic gates and digital circuits, totem pole outputs are used. Uh, <coughs> One another biggest uh, advantage of uh, um, the push-pull configuration is you have a good um, efficiency because there is uh, a <coughs> balanced operation between uh, the P and N MOSFETs that are formed. Uh, so uh, this uh, uh, basically um, is one of the major advantage to reduce the power so if you see a simple configuration of totem pole it looks like this um, and uh, uh, actually most of the design engineers uh, do not talk <coughs> totem pole and push pull separately but uh, definitely uh, there are some differences associated with it and uh, these are some of them which are listed uh, hope we gave a little clarity on totem pole versus uh, push pull. Please post if you have any questions. Thank you.